Welcome, welcome, welcome to American Sports Live. I'm your host, Jared Quay, with a lot of shit to say. Crazy week in the world, goddammit. Breaking news. The Klan is back, and they took off their hoods, and they're wearing t-shirts with the Twitter handle on it, holding hands with other neo-Nazis, and holding tiki torches. I knew it was going to be some backfire when OJ got released, but not this much. And for that, I need to do some stress eating. As recommended by my good friend, Tina Fey, just eating a little bit of cake makes things easier. Some good cake. But it still don't change the fact that Donald John's handsome ass is openly taking credit for blackballing Colin Kaepernick. At the same time, he took forever to condemn white supremacists saying it was violent on many sides. So you know what? Fuck you, Donald Trump. And he's holding a rally in the same city my mother lives in right now to part of the most racist chef of all time. And although this cake is really good, it just don't feel right sitting back and watching this go down. So I think I need to be in the front line with those six four black drag queens. Cause if everything goes back to normal, then nothing's changed. That's a lot of damn calories I just ate. Next story, the NFL preseason is back and it's about as boring as a WNBA basketball game. But the first 10 minutes of it is amazing because you don't know what's gonna happen. That's right, the national anthem gets sang and it's like a game of musical chairs. Which one of you is gonna sit down this time? And I love it. And thank you to Chris Long for being the first white brother to step out. That's right, you were the Eminem of this thing. Now we just need the g Easy, the Mac Millers, the Mac Lamores, the Machine Gun Kellys, and Little Dickies. Will all the white rappers that support black music please sit down for the anthem? Next story, Sin News is my favorite thing to text to people, but I don't like these ones. That's right, Tiger Woods and his ex-girlfriend, Lindsey Vaughn, news have been released. And I never like to kick people when they're down and vulnerable in times like this, but at the same time, you knew what you were doing. You sent that as a message. When will older people learn how to use Snapchat? But this gives us a really good time to know if Tiger Woods is more black or Asian. Because he did denounce black people back in the day, but at the same time, he went off and cheated with a bunch of heavyset white women, which says nigga to me. Floyd Mayweather has a huge brawl this weekend, but that's not what we're talking about because he just got upset because Justin Bieber done followed him. That's right, Justin Bieber says he wants to be closer to God and got to get away from distractions. And I think Floyd Mayweather with a bunch of twerking strippers and a bunch of money hitting the ground could be distracting or could be very religious. That's right, God know what I want. Please bless me, Lord. All right, guys, that's been our show, American Sports Live. I'm your host, Jerry Quay. So let's see me something sexy. Fuck Donald Trump.